Welcome to Weed Entertainment. And look at this bud. We're going to start off. I'm not even going to tell you what it is. Look at this bud. Oh my goodness. It's incredible. This is something called Styrofoam Cup. And it's from Team Elite Genetics. And I hate the name Styrofoam Cup. But I look at this bud and I think to myself, this is a smart company. Why would you call something Styrofoam Cup? It's so beautiful. I would have a much better name than that. But this is going to be our try for the day. Let me give a quick shout out to Vapor Cup. And then we're going to talk about this flower. I have one bong hit or three little scoops of Styrofoam Cup and Vapor Cup straw. I use Vapor Cup. I've been using this thing for like eight years. It's just such a game changer. Especially as you learn that your throat's getting burned from the bong. And you have years and years and years of bong use in you. I'm using flowers every day for 40 years, right? That is a long time. So if you're looking for something a little bit lighter, a little bit sweeter, that will still kick your ass if you got the right flowers, because flowers matter. This cup plus the right flowers, and that's what the show showcases, can make you feel like you can touch the stars. So let me stick this down into the vapor cup. It'll be ready to go in about a minute and a half. If you don't have it, vaporcup.com. On with the show. So Styrofoam Cup was a 2022 Cannabis Cup winner. And this was not, you know, a lot of times I picked by name. And I, there was like 10 strains of, uh, of Team Elite Genetics at Trees Dispensary down in, oh my goodness, in Echo Park. And so as I looked at this one, I picked it because it was a winner and I bought all the winners. And so how does it rate against the really good team elite genetics flowers? I tried two prior to this, two old ones back in 19 and both of those flowers got the nine. One was called uh, cookie dough. The other one was biscotti. And then I don't really see team elite, elite genetic, excuse me, team elite genetics around. This is a flower grown in Hollywood. They are involved with Dr. Dina or Dr. 420. She is the person they made the Weeds TV show about. And she has great flowers. She has a great team around her. So let's check out Styrofoam Cup. This flower has 37.87% THC. It seems like every flower is in the 30s right now. It's just crazy. What can you tell from that? Not much, right? So let's check it out. Here we go. Styrofoam by Team Elite Genetics at a vapor cup at the low temperature of 330. And I use 330 because I think that's the temperature that gives the most flavor, most flavorful draws. I can get maybe 10, 12 really flavorful draws instead of one bong it. I love this thing. Especially if you're sitting around on the weekend and you just want to use and, you know, watch some TV like I watch UFC. I love this thing. Greatest thing ever. Let's check it out. So this really does taste like some kind of OG Kush to me. And a lot of the team elite genetic strains are OG Kush tasting. I thought this is one of the stronger uh, team elite genetic strains with Novocaine. This is a strong flower. One thing though, some flowers are like Novocaine was long lasting. This one really wasn't that long lasting. It does have some focus and it was even, and it had some euphoria. So how does it dock rate it? We're looking for the best and you got to stay tuned because I'm going to line all eight of these Team Elite genetic strains up and pick which one's got the, the doc's favorite, which one's got the most euphoria and really it comes down to that in the end of the day. So what is the Doc Rate Styrofoam by Team Elite Genetics? I'm giving this flower an 8.7. And I think it would have got a higher rating for me, except it went away real fast. Some of the flowers can last eight hours on me. This one, I think that wore off maybe in two and a half hours, which most flowers last longer than that on me.
but an 8.7 is good. This is a good flower. If you're looking for a good, smooth, strong flower, styrofoam is a try. Thanks for joining in on the dock. Stay tuned. You got to watch the overview. I'm going to line up all eight strains. Which is my favorite Team Elite genetic strain? Stay tuned on the dock. I'll be back. If I'm not here, my website is weedentertainment.com. If you have a tip for the dock and it's not gelato, leave it below the video. If you got some love for me, post it down there too. I appreciate all the love. I really work hard to try and figure out which flowers are the most euphoric for myself. And us sharing information, I'm telling you, we are, I don't even say we're buying right. We're buying better than we would without the information, right? Right now, it's just an average gelato market, but we're going to get out of this. Thanks for joining in. I'll be back. Party on, my friends. Thank you.